Hi there fishing buddies, uh, welcome back to the channel and uh, see what we're in store for today. Take care of all. Right there fishing buddies, uh, we've gone on to one of local lakes which I've got a permit for and the first part of this video is going to be for the rod race but the second part we actually went down for um, a pleasure session and I'm going to add that bit into the rod race also. Uh, stay till the end because absolutely brilliant and uh, had some wicked carp and some other silvers and whatever obviously after this trying to catch a rod so stay tuned see if we get a rod and uh, take care all thanks for thanks again for watching thank you so you join me today um i've been coming down for a pleasure session and uh, we're already here so what i'm going to do is try and catch a rod uh, rod race have a nice carp there's another little carp and a roach so uh, I'm going to start from now, see how many fish, I have an hour, so I'm going to feed on maggot. I'm feeding maggots, um, there's carp all over the place, so. pellets, oh, I'm fishing on, a little dibber float, about four foot plumbed up, so that's what plan of action, so I'm going to get an hour, plenty of carp, I want to catch carp, I'm pleasure fishing today, but I might as well get an hour's with them on this rod race while we're here. So, it's two mile here, two mile back. So, that's four mile out in the keep net. So at least if I catch four fish, I've not lost any. So let's see where we're going on. Take care. So I've just looked into my first fish. Just got a bream. Literally that in seconds. There you go, first fish. Bream. He's gone back in. Jump into the next fish. Literally, fish a tube. I think it might be a small carp. Fish on double white maggot. Up, I think. Kicking about a bit. 
little cup. Wait, come on. Get some spinach fish. Another little cup. Talked into another fish. Let's leave a couple of seconds for the fish. Another little carp. Fish snap. So I'm gonna show you what I'm doing. The camera's in the right way, I'll put it. Double white maggot. Maybe four or five put them in and put some in there. Keep it right now. I'm just going to use a tad little digger float. After a road. Mm -hmm. That's a small one, please. Yeah. I'll have ten more minutes, because like I said I've come pleasure fishing. Didn't get a rod. I can't win back on top of the carp. A little rope. 
fishing chuck, but I've come to come pleasure fishing, so what I'm gonna do is end it there. And uh, I'll tell him up, I'll let him take the knife. And uh, I'm kind of catching his pro. I'm using the sucker method. Stick on the pellet. I'll do a video on this. I've got a blood rod race on the pellet. On the power top kit. Leading these in bait pup and picking carp off top. So got another fish on. Another fish. Another small cup. Thank <laughs> you. 
coming. Just hooked into another one. I just smashed my third section, so I've got to repair it. Nice mirror. I'm getting up sucker method. He's going to be lively. Two or three hundred pounds. Here he comes. Left it. Nose. And I get pulled under water, got disturbance.
this point, why take your time? Don't bully it, don't rush him. We'll give up eventually. We'll all love it line. to give up now. There you go. He's in there. Another comment. Still be a bit lively. That's that's a better fish. That might make five five and a half six pound. Definitely lively. back in. And away he goes. Process, I can see another carp feeding. He's feeling confident, he's got his nose. Another carp in this headlock feeding, it's a decent size. <laughs> He's a good size there, look. I'm trying to get on camera. Constantly watching all the time, watching the water, watch carp moving. There's two or three here, look. Back in the middle. Boys, not next to it. Won't take it. Two hundred. Three, four. He's coming in. Straight past it, that big one. Oh, he's there. Big mouth. Big mouth. Go on, take it. Oh, get in. Jane, I've got a good one. I've got it on camera. <laughs> I'll watch that, come and take it. When that mouth come up, he looks like a good fish. No more biscuits and keep them occupied. It's going to take a bit longer to get out, I think. Oh yeah, you can tell when the better fish. When I fished it the other day, I used uh, floating dog biscuits with rod, and uh, they were turning on line. So I thought I'd use pole today, fish direct to them. We're at Wood's Head today and it's a lovely venue. That's permit holders only. And it's been like this all day, fishing like this all day. And I wanted to catch a rod from the uh, rod race. But I'm pleasure fishing today, so... Okay.
a look at the size of this one. This is a good one. We'll get it in. Down to the last two. I'll try and get a photo with this one, I think. Wait for Becca to come right on the other side. I had a dress carp yesterday, so I'm targeting dress carp in here as well. It's a decent sized fish for this pond. This is a good one. Eight pounds six, I think, the biggest yesterday. He's a belter, absolute belter. He's a double. Get him. Got him. What bigger fish? What better? weight on this one but a lot better fish see it now down. still got some kick in him beautiful carp absolutely beautiful I'm just gonna rest him on get some pictures and weigh him up again have a belter Process, I can see another carp feeding. He's feeling confident, he's got his nose. Another carp in this headlock feeding, that's a decent size. <laughs> he's a good size there, look. Trying to get on camera. Constantly watching all the time, watching the water, watch cart moving. There's two or three a lot. Stop it in the middle. And there's always night next to it. One ticket. Two under it. Three, four. Keep coming in. Straight past it, that big one. Holy oh, deal, big mouth. Big mouth, go on, take it. Oh, get in. Jane, I've got a good one. I've got it on camera. <laughs> oh, watch that, come and take it. And that mouth go up, he looked like a good fish. Biscuits and keep them occupied. This is going to take a bit longer to get out, I think. Oh, yeah, you can tell when the better fish. When I fished it the other day, I used uh, floating dog biscuits with rod, and uh, they were turning on line. So I thought I'd use pole today. Fish direct to them. Look at Woods Head today, and it's a lovely venue. That's permit holders only. And it's been like this all day, fishing like this all day. And I wanted to catch a rod from the uh, rod race. But I'm pleasure fishing today, so.
Okay, a look at the size of this one. This is a good one. We'll get it in. Down to the last two. I'm trying to get a photo with this one, I think. Wait, Becca's come round from the other side. I'm going to dress corp yesterday, so I'm targeting dress corp in here as well. It's a decent sized fish for this pond. This is a good one. Eight pounds six, I think, the biggest yesterday. He's a belter, absolute belter. He's a double. Get him. Got him. What bigger fish? What better? weight on this one but a lot better fish see it now down. still got some kick in him beautiful carp absolutely beautiful I'm just gonna rest him on get some pictures and weigh him up again have a belt Like I said, in pleasure session, and I'm getting them on the top carp. Been snapped once. This feels like a good ingen. And that was a monster that's come up there. Yeah, it definitely feels like a better fish.
Money. So we put them on hook in the map. Five pounds, that's it, five, six pounds. Love the fish. Going to the small cap. I want dog biscuit. On it top lip. Calm down, mate. Calm down. About two and a half, three pound again. Come on. If you look, the carp are coming up and I'm watching them. Wherever they're feeding, I'm trying to drop it on the reds. There's one right next to my biscuits, so I'm not going to move it. I might take that one. There's one under it now, look. It's spooked. There's one turning. You can sit and wait, or you can try and stalk them. Wonder it. About to get off, and I've just up on another species of grass carp. I can get it in, I've got that 10% back to the left. Wow. and land it as quick as possible. Wow, look at this babe, come look at this. Jesus. God's truth. Massive. Sit still, mate. All right, pal. All right. All right. Is there only two or three of them in there? Yeah. What's well, somebody had one yesterday? Can we move this pole back a little bit? I haven't looked yet. I haven't. Uh, it's the first one I've seen. It's been a lovely fish, haven't it? Yeah. Be a good fight. Grass carp. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna got such a strong mouth. Look at length size of that. Well, I'm gonna 
I'm just going to rest it a minute. Oh, this is the end of the year, you'll never come across one. No, there was a man on the bottom yesterday. <laughs> Fishing buddies, I'm just doing editing for this video. Really enjoyed that session, it was brilliant. Uh, there was 40 miles left in the keep net. I caught 20 fish and it's 4 miles travelling. There's at least 56 miles left in the keep net. And I'm well happy to get that grass carp. And believe it or not, the week after that, I went down uh, in a pleasure session with a friend. I managed to catch exactly the same fish again. So stay tuned all and thanks for your support. And see you again. Thank you. What I'm going to do, I'm going to end the session right here, even though I'm still going to fish for a few more hours. Uh, thanks all for your support again. And uh, stay tuned till the next one. Take care all. Thank you. Take care. I'm just about to get a carp on. <laughs> We can get one more on before I leave. There you go. Gotta get one more on. It's like taking candy off a baby, Jen. Not as big as the last one. That's what happens when you're watching what you're doing and when you're fishing. So I'm definitely going to end the video right here. Support everything and uh, pull up this last fish, show About three and a half. Oh, get it. Sit down. It's going in there. Don't put it back in. Next one. So that's a massive shout out to Darren from South Shields, All Seasons Sea Fishing. Great guy he is, so please check his channel out, I will be leaving the description below. Also tackling mines, uh, Dave Lyons is the co-founder and New Beginnings Fishing, my own Facebook group, I'll be leaving a description and link below to all of them. Now I'd like to say a bit of stuff about this tackling mines, um, I'm loving the group that they've got 
I want to join the group. There's quite a lot of people that's in it, and obviously people struggle with anxiety and depression and mental health, same as I do myself. At times it can be really hard. So please check out this group. Awesome job that the guys doing. They're going around to ponds and chatting away to people and doing what they're doing and uh, doing an amazing job helping people for more walks of life. I mean, fishing's, as I said, not just a sport, it's a way of life. So it's an easy way to get away from everything and keep his mind going and doing what we're doing. So thanks ever so much. Uh, I'd also like to thank everybody who was on the group. Uh, everybody who's subscribed, all my fishing buddies and everything else. Massive thanks to everybody for your support. At the time it's not been easy, but we're getting there and uh, we're getting there in the end. So just a massive thank you to everybody. Don't forget to become a fishing buddy because every 100 subscribers we will be having a prize giveaway. And uh, we'll make sure that it's drawn out and uh, it gets to yourself. So I'd just like to say a massive thanks to everybody for all your support and everything else and uh, just stay tuned and we'll see what we're doing next week or week after when we're fishing. So thanks again everybody, massive thanks to everybody for everything. So thank you and take care and wait to see what is on the next video. Thanks again.